Right now, we're in a financial crisis in almost every corner of the world. In a crisis, whether it's the world, your industry, or just your organization, financial metrics become even more important than ever before. When you have to create the reports of financial data in a crisis, I think there are three requirements you should consider. First, the message needs to be crystal clear for the executives because they have to make decisions quickly in a crisis. I suggest you use graphs instead of tables of numbers. They're much easier for the executives to understand, grasp that message so that they can make decisions. Second, you need the graphs created quickly, like yesterday. You don't have time to learn some complex software or put together a dashboard. Use what you and your team already know, trusty Excel. You can create Excel charts that are effective and go way beyond the basic charts, column and line that you learned early on. Third, the charts need to be easy to update because you're gonna to have to be updating them daily, not the monthly frequency that you're used to. Here are some tips for creating Excel charts to report financial data in a crisis. First, make sure that every chart has a title that contains the key message of that chart. The title combined with the visual is gonna create a light bulb moment for the executives so they understand the message and can make decisions based on that message. Here's an example of a chart title that works with the chart to convey an important message about days of cash on hand, a critical metric during a crisis. Second, add explanations in as part of the chart. So you answer the questions before they get asked. This is critical in a crisis because time is a precious commodity. This line chart builds in explanations of key changes to answer what happened at those specific times. Third, guide the viewer through the chart so they don't have to ask how to understand or interpret it. This chart uses light lines to guide the viewer's eyes along the path between the columns and segments. Fourth, build Excel charts that are formula driven. So when the data is updated from the analysis, the chart updates automatically and is ready right away for the executives. This chart is built so that it automatically adjusts to the data and it can be sorted differently by changing one cell. And fifth, create each chart on its own worksheet that's structured into three sections, the data from the analysis, the chart data table, and the chart itself. Combining this with building charts that are formula driven makes it much easier to reuse the chart with other data. This saves you time and makes it easier to satisfy those executive requests. This worksheet is a good example of creating the three sections, the data that comes from the analysis on another worksheet, the chart data table, and the chart itself. If you want to get a quick start on creating Excel charts for financial reporting to executives, check out the link below where you can access templates for the charts you saw and many more charts that are useful for reporting financial data in a crisis.